with optimism for a better Kenya at its peak among workers, it appears that the government should brace itself for a series of strikes with nurses and staff at the Kenyatta National Hospital threatening to follow teachers in their pursuit for higher pay. Kudedia Chair Jared Onamo says the hospital management has failed to honor a ruling by the industrial court issued on October 2011 that would have seen their basic pay rise by 46%. Uh, initially when we were, we were in court they were promising that if the case is over they shall implement. But immediately after the award was given by the court they changed the tune. And we have been giving them two weeks, two weeks, even the last day we gave them two weeks, two weeks which is 14 days ending today. And today when we met, they, they told us that we should give them another month to implement the, the, the CBA, which, which to us it is impossible because even the workers behind me can ban me. Kenyatta National Hospital nurses representative Obuya Obengo claims that the delays in the implementation of the collective bargaining agreement has seen arrears accumulate to 1.3 billion shillings, amount owed to the 4,500 staff at the Kenyatta National Hospital. Our money, which is a total of uh, 1.7 billion to pay for us the salaries and allowances according to the court award, was factored the budget. But we hear between parliament and treasury, something is amiss. So we are telling even the people of treasury, kama hawa meshindo na kazi yao wakuja kumana jidizasta hapa kenyata na situ wende fanya kazi kwa treasury. The union says it members will have no option but to down their tools starting tomorrow until the government honors the court ruling. Brenda Kiprono reporting for Challenge 1 News Hour.